are back now with a true story about drug addiction and forgiveness. Author Javeda Smith knows firsthand what it's like, and she is joining us to share her story. Javeda, thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you for having me. Thank yes. you for having and so me. you brought your book as well. It's yes. Get Yourself Together First. And I mean, that's Absolutely. you put the message on the front of the book here. Absolutely. Um, but let's start with a little bit about your life, because it's such a harrowing um, just experiences that you went through. Tell me a little bit about what you went through and your decision to write a book about it. So I grew up my mother was an addict um, my grandparents raised me so I was raised in a, a great home with an amazing family with a lot of love but nothing ever takes away that longing that you have for your mother yes. and so I grew up watching my mother um, as an addict um, I went through all of the pains of uh, the embarrassment or just seeing her that way but then in 1999 her whole life turned around she wow. did not want it anymore and she changed everything and there was a point where I realized hey I'm not the only one who went through this and if I can forgive my mother and then we can move on to the rest of our lives then so can other people but you only hear from addicts. Mm -hmm. You don't hear from the children of addicts and what they feel like and how they got to forgiveness. And so many families are broken. I mean, even going into the next year, they're broken because of what somebody did five or 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. They have not moved on for that. And forgiveness is so important. It is so keen. And you've revealed a lot of details. I mean, a lot of things that people often are too afraid to share or too afraid Absolutely. to even speak out loud. Absolutely. Um, will you share just some some of the reasons behind what you wanted to share and why well the thing is um, so we have the me too movement we have um, we have so many different things women empowerment we have so many mental health drug addiction my book touches on it all it's we have things that go on in life like the dirt that go on in the church that's swept up under the rug and nobody talks about but the fact of the matter you have a conglomerate of broken people and if somebody doesn't stand up and say hey me too that was me I went through it too um, nobody will get healed and what has happened I did a book tour I met several people what has happened get yourself together first has become a universal message in relationships and you know it has become so much more than about the book we want people to move out of one thing into the next and sometimes people go through things they have to regroup mm -hmm. Yes. before inviting others in so they have to get their self together first. You can't get to forgiveness until you've addressed what right. you've been through absolutely. and come to terms with, with absolutely. that. Absolutely, absolutely. And even moving on into 2020, my daughters are going on tour mm -hmm. talking about the brokenness that, that their father and I have even caused in their lives mm -hmm. and how they had to see me get their myself together first before they made so many demands so we're using our pain as a message to just draw families back together. And how do you start the conversation, especially with kids, when you're the parent and maybe you know that some of the decisions you made might have affected their lives negatively, especially when you've gone through so much when you were a child yourself? Well, if I'm completely honest, I have an older brother, and he said, what you have to do is get each one of your children one by one. Mm. And I don't care how they have to express their self. Let them get it out. They have that right to share that pain. I didn't want to do it, <laughs> but <laughs> you saw um, a need but there it. was a need for yeah. it. And when my daughter, they just spoke out, when they started speaking out, I sat behind them and I listened to their heart, things I never knew they felt. Wow, incredible. Where can people get more information and more information about the book? So um, you can visit my website website which is www.gavata my name javeda.org um, my book is available everywhere Amazon Barnes and Noble Walmart Target books a million I book Kindle Nook you can find the book anywhere sounds great Javeda thank you so thank much you so and we'll much. of course put that link on our website wgla.com as well thank you thank you so, you so much. much thank we're, you we're gonna head over now to and we are back now with a true story about drug addiction